In a worrying discovery, almost 800 children were found inside a mass grave close to a former home for children and their unwed mothers. The children are thought to have been buried between 1925 and 1961 in a septic tank on the grounds of the home in Tormin Island. The grisly find was made by two young boys who stumbled upon the unmarked graves when they were playing close to the location of St. Mary's mother and baby home that has since been developed into the residential estate. Currently, officials in Ireland are scrambling to figure out the way to move forward, while Catholic Church leaders are meeting to talk about plans for a memorial for the close to 800 children. Kieran Cannon, the Minister of State at the Department of Education is demanding for an investigation into the mass graves. In the meantime, Catherine Collis, a local historian has looked into the troubled history of the home, a workhouse, which grew to be a home for moms and their babies in the twenties by the Sisters of Bonsecours. When Catherine searched the mass grave for the children's death certificates, she learned there were 796 dead, starting from infants to nine-year-olds. Corliss is leading a campaign to raise money for a memorial, which will list the children's names.